All right, so what is up everybody and welcome back to New Life Sneakers. So today I have these shoes with me, KD5s that I got um, from eBay for only $20. I was going to do a restoration video on these, but I got a comment from Captain Maya that says, how will a simple soap and water work? So today we're gonna test that out. Instead of using a souvenir like I usually do, I'm gonna actually try and see how just, you know, soap and water is gonna work. Cause I honestly have no idea. So we're gonna try this out. I will be using rejuvenator brushes because you know, you're gonna need like a brush. You can't just use soap and water and then like use your hands. You're going to need a brush of some sort. So that's what we're going to do. Let's see how this works. Alright, so for the purpose of the video, I'm going to only work on the right shoe and I'm going to make this one all clean or as clean as I can with just soap and water and then we're going to see, you know, at the end, we're going to put them side by side and we're going to see which one looks better. All right, so here is just the soles. Just the, I want to cut off right here, but soles look a, a little bit better. This is the clean one, this is the dirty one. Not a huge difference, but it definitely did something. The soles are yellow, that's why it's, it doesn't look super clean, but um, so I will have to use like Soul Bright or something to um, unyellow the soles, but that's how they look right now. Um, All right, so I let it finally dry, and um, this is what the final product looks like. So here's the clean one, obviously, on the left, and then here's the dirty one that I haven't cleaned on the right. We're gonna go over the soles again. So soles, this one does look a little bit brighter, a little bit cleaner, but it could be better. Yeah, that's how the soles look. I'll definitely have to unyellow them after I clean them, so I'll probably make a separate video on that, maybe, possibly. If you can see that, the this one is a lot brighter. It's hard to get it on camera, but after I cleaned it over, the midsoles are a lot dirtier than on the dirty one than the clean one right here. The mesh right here, still has some dirt in that little mesh cage area while well, this one's pretty clean the cleaner one just looks a lot brighter to be honest um i don't know if the camera's picking up very well but it does look a lot nicer for example this blue is just a lot more rich and this one just kind of looks dirty still here's how the tongues look um this one right here as you can see is a lot brighter um, and then this one, there's still a lot of dirt embedded into that mesh right there. And now that I bring it closer, this whole entire tongue just looks a lot dirtier than this one on, that I cleaned. So um, that's what that looks like. It's not a gigantic difference for sure, but it definitely did the, did the job, I would say. Um, so I would say it does work. I would try this again, possibly, but... Um, I would, I'd probably stick to just rejuvenator. All right, so that is pretty much the end of this video. Like I said, simple soap and water did work. Like it did its job, um, but I think rejuvenator would have done a lot better. But like I said, I couldn't just clean it with soap and water, so I had to use the rejuvenator brushes. So if you want to get any of the products that I use in this video, I have a 50% off discount code called New Life Sneaks. I have, I'll put a picture up, show you all the details and all that. Um, links in the description below to get to their website. I, you know, when you're purchasing, and you're about to check out, all you gotta do is enter my code in, new life sneaks, pretty simple. It'll give you 50% off your whole entire order. So yeah. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy, do not forget to hit that like button and also subscribe if you guys are new. And again, thank you guys so much for watching and peace out.